everybody! I am going to do a stocking stuffer video for you today. So we have these ginormous stockings. These were actually made for us by um, a social worker um, a lot of years ago. She gave them to us for some kids that were with us at the time and then um, they wound up not going with the kids because they were packed away after Christmas. And So I decided to use them this year and it's a good thing because I ended up getting a lot of stocking stuffers this year. Um, I love going to the Dollar Tree for stocking stuffers because you can get so much stuff, um, and it's a dollar. It's a great price. So, um, I didn't find all the things that I usually get, like, um, the Play-Doh. I always put Play-Doh in their stockings, and usually they have, it's either a four or five pack, and they only had the two pack this year. Um, but that's okay because they still got a lot of really great stuff. So, I'm only going to do one of the stockings because they have the exact same stuff in it. Our girls are twins. They're eight-year-old twins. And so the only difference would be the color. One of our daughters loves pink and the other loves purple. So, I'm going to take the purple stocking and show you what's in it. Let me get comfortable here. Okay, so... I found these at Walmart. I think these are so sweet, just little slippers. And we were at Walmart today shopping, and she's like, Mommy, can you buy me these slippers? And I'm like, No, Santa's fixing to come. Well, you know, Christmas is coming. Um, so she'll be re really happy about that. Um, my mother in law sent him this, this pen. Super cute. There's that. This is kind of a strange item. So it is a um, coal stress ball. You take it out of the package. So my my daughter asked for this. I don't know that she knows what a stress ball is, but it is a stress ball. Um, and it's not one of the good ones either. But it's what she wanted. I found, got 12 of them at Oriental Traders for like $14. So um, I'm aiming to please this year. Um, so I got her what she wanted. She'll probably not like it. But anyway. Um, I got them a scribble pad. This is paper I always get from the Dollar Tree. It's just great for them to have. Um, some Just some socks. They love socks. Found those at the Dollar Tree for a dollar. I got them each a brush, one purple and one pink. And some candy. Since they have braces, they can't have any of the fun candy. Like any of the, they can't have hard candy. They can't have anything marshmallowy, anything chewy. So um, I just got them some milk chocolate candy. Um, now these, this might seem like a weird stocking stuffer, but they are constantly asking for pipe cleaners. And um, I always keep some because I always, I keep a, you know, a lot of craft supplies around. Um, so I figured they would love to have their own. So I got those. Um, let's see, peanut butter Santas. Some sixlets. I think that's how you say it. Um, a pack of rubber bands. One of my girls' hair, we're growing out a um, pixie cut, so she will be very happy. Um, she's almost to the point where she can use the rubber bands again. Um, a flashlight, I put this in the wrong one. Um, they love flashlights, so now they'll each have their own. This should be in the other one. Some more candy. Um, I found this at Walmart, but it was it was only a dollar. Um, decorative nail art, and they're really cute. Um, little charms and little stickers. Um, so they, they'll have fun with that for a day. Um, a Slinky Junior. We always sing this song, the Slinky song, so that's just a fun little family joke kind of gift. Um, Christmas socks. Some gum. So, um, I need to take one pack out of this because I ran out of gum and I was like, oh, I got gum for their stockings. So before church Sunday morning, I raided their stockings and took a pack of gum out of the other one. So I need to take one out of here. Um, but they can chew um, several different types of gum with their braces, and Orbit's one of them, and what kid doesn't love gum? I got this at Walmart, the Pampery Body Lotion. It is, I think it's cupcake flavor. I don't know. It's got a cupcake on it. So that'll be fun for them. 
Um, pencils, you know, we homeschool. Pencils are a big deal to kids. They like fun pencils, so I got um, a bunch of pencils. Um, I didn't even put them all in their stockings. And I just got a pack of pens um, and gave them their different colored pens um, so they can write in their little little books. I got them some body wash. I found this at the dollar store, which was cool. It comes with a little keychain on it. Who is it? It's um, Olaf. And then I got them, I found these at Oriental Traders. They're lipstick erasers. So we lose erasers constantly. Um, we use mechanical pencils most of the time. Um, so erasers are always a big deal. So they won't lose these because they'll love them so much they'll keep them. At least that's the plan. So I put six of them in each stocking and I still have some more. Um, they actually asked for this item. They wanted dry erase markers. We do have, and they're magnetic, we do have dry erase boards that we use for school and we have two hung up in our kitchen area, dining room area. Um, so those will be used. I just got them this little book. They each have one. It, I got this at the dollar store. It has a little little rubber band closer and um, just something for them to have. They see me with my little books all the time. and um, So it'll just make them feel grown up and they'll like it. Um, my mother-in-law sent these, um, just some Crayola Kleenex they can put in their little purses that they carry. Um, she also sent these. They are Dino Egg Bath Bombs. So that will be really cool. Um, my blonde daughter, Riley, she is totally into dinosaurs. She loves dinosaurs. So um, that'll be cool. We haven't seen the Jurassic Park movies yet. Um, I've seen Jurassic Park, but she hasn't seen any of them yet. So um, she'll really like this. Um, there's, I think they each have two of them in their stockings. See, I think we're getting to the end. Was that it? That was it. So it doesn't seem, it seems like there should be more. But I think that's a lot. I think that's a pretty good stocking. And they have, on Christmas Eve, they will get, we do the Christmas Eve box, except I'm not putting a movie in there. Um, I'm just putting pajamas and hot cocoa and some snacks. And then we'll watch... One of the movies that's on ABC Family that I've been recording will probably watch How the Grinch Stole Christmas, but I did not buy them a movie. Um, I am going to put also in their stocking, I'm going to put, I got one of them Inside Out, which they've seen, but they like having the movie, and I got the new Minions movie. So that will be in their stocking as well. And so that's it. And the way we do stockings is the kids can get into their stockings, like if they get up before us, um, they can open their stockings. 